Hi, I'm Mandeep Singh, founder of Mandeeps.com and in this video we'll be working with our Mega Menu module for our Dixit skin. So let's get started. What I have here is a installation of .NET Mix 7 on which we've installed our Dixit skin and we went ahead and imported a portal template to create a demo site. Now you can go ahead and do the same, refer to our installation and portal template videos to get started. Now once you've done that, uh, I've, uh, I've logged in as a super user or someone who has access to make changes to the website like an administrator. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is change the menu structure uh, to use a mega menu structure. Spe specifically, this features right here, the short codes, components, and module themes. I would like these to be in a mega menu structure. So let's see how we do that. Well, the Dixit skin now comes with a new module called Dixit Mega Menu and you will see that uh, in your add new module control bar after you've installed the Dixit skin. So let's look for it and it's right here. It says Dixit Mega Menu. Alright, so let's add this module to a page. I'm going to add it to the admin page management just because it's the most logical place for it to be. Uh, it doesn't have to be on this page. You, you're free and welcome to add it wherever you like. So I'm going to go to add new module. I'm going to go ahead and grab that module and add it to our page. Okay, now that we have the TechSheet Mega Mini module on the page right here, it's very easy to go ahead and use it. So as I said, I wanted to take this features menu and make it a mega menu. So I'm going to choose features menu from here. I'm going to say I want this to be a three column mega menu. As you can see, it kind of gives me a visual representation that there'll be three columns of menu items. I'm going to go ahead and click save. And that's it. Uh, if I take a look at the menu, I see now it's been changed to a mega menu. I see three columns and I see all the menu items. Now if you see the Mega Menu is uh, it's still coming relative to the, the original root menu. If I want to go ahead and change that I can enable full width and hit save again. And now you see that the Mega Menu is full width and it uh, appears for the full width of the skin. So really it's that easy to go ahead and uh, convert your existing menu to mega menu using Dixit mega menu module. Now you still have the ability to move these components around left, right, up and down using the page management tool that you've, you're used to. Simply go into the features menu. If you want this to be the second column you move it down and so forth. If you want this moved up and down you just simply drag and drop and move them around from here and they will be reflected in your menu. So let's go ahead and wrap this demo by adding some arbitrary HTML content into the menu as well. So I'm going to say I want to add something on the right and it's giving me an option of a text editor and I already have some text here copied. In. So I'm just going to paste in here, save myself some time and it basically is a link. I'm going to click save again. Okay, let's take a look. There we go. Now we have the first three columns and we have some HTML module on the right. So that's it. That's how really easy it is to use Mega Menu module with our Diction Skin. If you have any questions or concerns, please do let us know. Thank you so much for watching the video.